All right, man, what's up? We back live, it's your boy Rebel. You know what I'm saying? This is WAK47HQ. Today's part of the show, we gonna flip it into something different, something we like to call Rare Gems, which is basically just giving props to all the gorgeous ladies out there doing their thing. You might have heard of them, you might not have heard of them, but either way it go, like I said, it's just giving props. And on today's show, we got one, you know what I'm saying? One of my favorites, of course, as well as the homies. Uh, her name is Miss Melissa Jimenez, coming out of Queens, New York, raised in the British, New Jersey. Um, she's affiliated, or was supposed to have had affiliation with Rough Riders crew. Uh, you know, might have messed with the Rockefeller crew, uh, doing her thing. She was on a joint with Beanie Siegel, you might have heard of it, Feel It In The Air. Um, also, she did a couple uh, other joints. One she had with Y Clef on a Carnival album, Volume 2, Memoirs of an Immigrant. Um, you know, just out there doing her thing. Very, very gorgeous. Um, you know, she's supposed to have some expected work to come out. We're looking forward to that. I don't know her personally, but like I said, just giving props to something, you know, that I think is gorgeous as well as everybody else, obviously. So on this part of the show, we salute Miss Melissa Aminez with a four carat. And uh, Nozaconi is here, ladies and gentlemen, or just gentlemen, you know what I'm saying? That's what's up. But uh, check out her, you know, website. If you know where, how to get it. Look it up, do what you gotta do. But uh, right now, we finna flip it into some other shit. And um, I'm gonna see y'all in a minute, man. But right now, y'all watching W A K 47. Check out one of the homies, he a gamer. See how he do, just a little whatever, chop it up. The homie Nova, so uh, man, check this shit out, man. It's all in. One more time for y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you didn't know, you know now. Outcast. Stay on ya. We shitting on everybody talking that bullshit. Now Peter Piper picked the pepper. That was his downfall. I'm down with Drake 2000 because he got my back, y'all. Ball if you want. All right, we here with a gamer, the homie Nova. We're gonna ask you a couple questions, trying to see what's up, man. What you think about bridging the gap between video games now and all the way up until, you know what I'm saying, what it was, you know what I'm saying? Well, to tell you the truth, I miss a lot of arcades, man. And that's what's used to bridge the gap. You got old school games and new school games. Yeah, you got old school games on the newer consoles, but it's nothing like getting in an arcade and actually grabbing a joystick, pressing down on the big buttons. With, with some class G, ask me, do I got some phone so you can blast me? Nasty, niggas on the butt, they see you shining. Engineers in the studio see me rhyming. Don't get me wrong, got four albums, stay consistent. You got a bodyguard, I let my nigga tote the biscuit. Put your cap back, you got blood up on your fur hat. Cap, cap, your link snap, you slumped up in your cat neck. For what though? Some diamonds in the Bentley, what you died for? I right, ho, I'ma bake my cheese and let my mic blow. Prioritize the live to. Tell these other niggas how you bought your kids some tennis shoes let these brothers know that you're my what you think about um, as far as it being a pastime because I remember when I was little 
You know what I'm saying? My, my brothers and them, my older brothers, they used to like, you know what I'm saying, go to the arcades, like Harkon and shit like that. You had one in Fox Hill, Culver City, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, the Lamo, you know what I'm saying? And so get the marina. Yeah, the marina too. So just a winner of finish, college without you, I doubt you. Do that though, so do this here and keep that bullshit out of my ear. You too near me not to hear me. Hear what you think is still hot, you know what I'm saying? Just from coming into an arcade right now. Arcade, Street Fighter versus anything is always hot. You got your Mortal Kombat. Got your your Tokyo drifts, you know what I'm saying? Your uh, need for speeds. You got your air hockeys. You got you know various things, your drivers, your shooters, your time cops. My overall favorite, hands down, arcade game ever, Street Fighter 2. You think you can hang 20 bucks a game? I'm playing with Chun Li. Who you rolling with? All right, man, so uh, for all the viewers, man, tell them where it's at, man, and what they watching, homie. You watching WAK47 Television. That's what's up. We on 8th and Broadway. Come holla at me. $20 game, Street Fighter 2.
All right, man, once again, it's your boy Rebel. I just got through watching episode two, WAK47. Hope y'all enjoyed that shit. A lot more where I came from, I promise. But for now, I'm finna do what I always do best, wrap it up. I'll let y'all in a minute. Get ready for episode three. In the meanwhile, I'm about to go have some fun, probably skate some shit. I don't know. Go fuck around, hang out with the homies, man. But, uh, holla. Yeah. This goes out to all the young people, all the old people, the real people, willing to fight this mind control they trying to put on us. They want to make us all lemmings and robots until our individuality is extinct. Trust me, it's not who you think. Yeah, feel free to eavesdrop. You speaking to your soul, speaking to your soul, speaking to your soul. Yeah, 